Hi, I'm Phil the Agronomist Jay Zilski, and the Pro Farmer Midwest Crop Tour is just around the corner. And every year, farmers ask me uh, about the methods that they use on the tour to make their corn yield calculations. And so I thought I'd briefly go over how they arrive at those numbers. So once they arrive at a field that they want to take a yield check in, they walk 35 paces beyond the end rows into that field. Then they measure off using a 30 foot length of rope or 30 foot tape. They take the average count of ears between those two rows. Then after that, they take the ear samples. And in order to make a random selection of the ears, they take the fifth, eighth, and 11th ear in a stretch of row. Then while they're out there, they measure the row width in inches. Now you obviously on your own farm are gonna know your row weight. Once they've taken those sample ears, they go back to the pickup to start to do some of the work. The first thing they do is determine the average length of grain on the ears that they sample. So they take a tape measure, measure the length of grain of those three ears, and take an average. Next, they then count the number of rows of kernels around those three ears and arrive at an average number of rows of kernels on those ears. So now it comes down to, to doing the math. So we take the number of ears, 58.5, times the number of rows of kernels around, that's 16, times the length of the ear in inches, which is seven. You do the math on those, you come up with 6,552. Then to make the final calculation, you take your row width. In our example, it's 30 inches, and you divide 6,552 by 30 inches, and you come up with 218 bushels an acre. Now you know how the Pro Farmer Crop Tour makes their corn yield estimates. Thank you very much, and good luck scouting. That concludes this Pioneer Growing Point Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.